Hello everyone, um, sorry for the, I'm not sure why this song is so menacing sounding. Um, I'm just getting set up, I hope you don't mind waiting too long. Uh, I just joined a new, uh, a, a new community server and usually they're pretty large and I get overwhelmed so I try not to, uh, I, I, I can't talk too long in them so before I get uh, before I freak out and have to hide. <laughs> um, but that's okay, that's okay. Uh, so today we're doing uh, more American Truck Simulator. Um, hopefully I updated everything correctly. I'm always afraid that I mess something up. Um, and I'm just we're gonna buy a new truck today. That's what I'm excited for. Uh, hello, um, welcome in. Uh, Burning Own It TV. Oh, Crockett, hello. Welcome back. You missed The Sims on uh, on Friday. Oh, American Truck Simulator has to update, actually. Hang on. It's only 65 megabytes, so it shouldn't be too long. Uh, you can always check out the uh, the Sims VOD uh, when you have free time, though. Um, I I'm sure you you might not have a lot. Um, you're probably very busy, but if you do, then it's available for you. This is a lot more viewers than I normally start a stream with. <laughs> um, welcome in, everyone. The game is just uh, updating now, so it shouldn't be too long before I can play again. I'm going to buy a truck, and we're going to have a lot of fun driving around uh, the United States. Well, hang on. It's a lot bigger of a download than I thought it was. It's apparently 13 gigabytes. Did they update the game? Did they install one of the new states? Maybe. I guess we'll be here together for a while. Uh, hey, Nico. Um, hope you don't mind the wait. Uh, so how has everyone's day been? Uh, it's been really, really hot up here um, for the last couple days. It's currently um, 28 degrees, I think. Um, it is a heat warning right now for the area. Yeah, it's supposed to go up to 33 tomorrow. Uh, thankfully, it's usually really cold in the mornings, so that's okay. Oh, you just woke up. Well, I hope uh, I hope you're waking up okay. You have a uh, coffee or orange juice or whatever you wake up with. I usually like to uh, get a glass of water and maybe a little tea while I wait for um, while I wait to wake up. I guess it's not always easy to wake up in the mornings. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I try not to drink too much coffee. Um, it, it's okay if other people do. It's just, for me specifically, um, I don't like the idea of uh, being too dependent on it. Um, my sister drinks a lot of coffee in the mornings, and she's very irritable. But uh, I try to avoid coffee specifically because I know uh, that caffeine uh, can be habit-forming, and that without it, it's harder to function in the mornings. Uh, that's just me, though. I do, uh, I, I, I don't want to make it sound like no one else can drink coffee. You can if you want. I'm sure there's good flavors out there. It usually smells very good, though.
Oh, yeah, it's very warm today. I had to take off my uh, my flannel jacket. <laughs> uh, thankfully, I was able to shower just before the stream um, about an hour ago after I'd finished eating. Uh, so I'm f feeling very good right now. How's everyone else doing? Other other than uh, Nico, who just woke up. Hmm. <sighs> it was a very quiet weekend. I'm a friend of mine. Uh, who lives in the U.S., um, he was able to go to, uh, I think it was Comic-Con. He sent a few pictures. Um, he was able to get me uh, some uh, merch for uh, a VTuber that I look up to. Um, be because, uh, well, she's very inspiring, not just because, well, it's, I I'm just going to come out with it and say that it is uh, Haruka Karibu. Um, I'm, I'm, Sort of, I, I, I like attending her streams when I'm able to. I kind of woke up to her and hope I can one day uh, meet her. Let me take a look at the download. Okay, we're getting close to the, uh, it, it says it's patching. We're getting very close to the 13 gigabyte, um... Uh, patch limit. Hopefully, it doesn't use too much space on my computer. I'm 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 getting close to running out. Okay, it looks like it's getting close to done here. One moment. There we go. I can play the game now. <laughs> Sorry, it took so long. Okay, the game is opening now. Usually that means I can't alt-tab away from it. So, sorry, you'll have to hear it before you can see it. Here we go. Ah, uh, yes. Let me alt-tab away, make sure I'm on the right programs, so I can see when you say things. Um, and then click continue game. There we go. Oh, I'd forgotten, uh, because I was last playing The Sims, uh, there's a lot, uh, hang on. There we go. Now I fit perfectly onto the screen. Hmm. There we are. Now, um, I, I'm able to buy a truck, but I only know a couple dealerships. I haven't been by too many of them. Uh, Bellingham and Western Star. I want to visit the selected dealer. Uh, yes, thank you. I want to see what sort of trucks I can buy. Oh, it's fairly small, all things considered. Oh, it's, it's really pricey, though. Maybe I should continue saving. I don't even have this much. Um, uh, yes, I can't afford that. I'm sorry. Um, let me try the other dealership. 
This one, I believe, is the other one. Oh, it's the same uh, configurations. Okay, it looks like I need to save a little bit more money before I can actually do this. Okay, man, we may have to get the truck partway through the stream instead of just now. Okay. Also, it seems like the game is a lot quieter than normal. I'm not sure why that is. Does everything seem quieter to everyone else? Can you, can you hear anything? Uh, other, other than me. Okay, thank, thank you. Uh, I just want to make sure that no, nothing is too quiet. It feels very quiet to me. Okay. Let's start in um, this city and see if we can go uh, east. There we go. Into Utah. That seems like it'll be fine. There we go. Still can't afford our own truck, but that'll be part way through. That'll be later on tonight. I do, though, plan on buying it. I do. That is a plan of mine. But everyone, welcome in. Um, please get comfortable, and I hope you have something to drink. Make sure you're hydrating yourselves. It's very warm right now. Um, I saw pretty distressing news that uh, in the... Oh, this is very interesting looking. Uh, that in the uh, American Southeast, that there is... Um, uh, the temperature is getting very high and it's, the humidity is getting very bad that you can't um, that you can't even sweat it, it, it just it, it just stays hot and it feels very bad that that's going on Okay, here we go. Never started in a suburban area before. This is very interesting. Um, I do like the way things look. And I've never been in a city like this um, before. Well, I guess maybe it's not a city. A recruitment agency. Oh, very nice. There seems to be a large cathedral over there. Oh, I guess I'm running a yellow. I'm not sure what I think of this. These people talking in my in my music. There we go. Ah, welcome to Idaho. <laughs> in case you were unaware of where you were, now you know you're in Idaho. I guess it makes playing GeoGuessr easier. Not that I can play GeoGuessr. The, uh, you have to sign up for an account now. You can't just play it for free anymore. Miss the days that you could. Um, I didn't do it very often, but I did enjoy watching uh, people play the game on YouTube. It was a lot of fun. Oh, I'm sorry. I 
have to remember to stay in the lines. I'll be sure to look out. Look out the window at the environment. We're entering a very deserty area. Which I think is very fitting considering um, how hot it is today. Oh, uh oh. Okay, I think I'm doing okay. Whew, okay, I, I'm doing all right. I made it up the hill. Things are going okay. I was a little worried um, uh, this morning when I woke up. I guess I'm being hit by a little bit of anxiety, but... I wasn't, uh, I thought that I would get zero viewers and no one would show up. It's, it's a little stupid and I'm sorry. Um, be sure to drink milk. <laughs> um, I, I guess I'm just still kind of nervous about, uh, about streaming in general. I'm not sure if it's the idea that there will be eyes watching everything I do or that even if I try for that, that there won't be. I'm not entirely sure how I feel on the matter. It makes me anxious all the same. I'm glad that I haven't met anyone, um, anyone bad yet. Anyone who sucks, you know? Everyone's been really kind and really friendly, and I'm very glad for that. See, it says it's 33 degrees Celsius outside the truck. Oh, hello. Um, I need to... I'm gonna drive all over the road. I get those feelings sometimes too, but just have fun with it. It's more enjoyable to watch someone have fun and enjoy the game they are playing than to watch someone who is only expecting views, is only playing game for said views. Yeah, I do understand that. Um, and I'm definitely not just doing Twitch so people can watch. Honestly, that is some part of what scares me. Um, I just want everybody to have a good time, and for the most part, it sounds like everyone is. Um, but there's always a voice in the back of my head saying that uh, if, they're, if they're watching, then they're not having fun, and I'm just making it all up, you know? All trucks right lane, all right. Thankfully, even going downhill, I'm still staying under the speed limit. Oh, I have to pull in. I'm not sure why a car would pull through here. But I need to make sure I need to make sure that the cops know that I'm not smuggling anything through the bulldozer in the back. Stop at the truck, scale ahead, and activate the icon. I right, give it a second. Need to pull in nice and easily. All right. I didn't really want to slow down because it'll be hard to get back up to speed, but... As long as everyone in the game knows that I'm not doing anything wrong, then that's, that's, that's a good feeling. <laughs> Now, it's difficult to pull up to, uh, to highway speed while I'm, before I can, because my vehicle is heavy. Here 
Maybe that's why trucks are supposed to stay in the right lane. They're very large vehicles. They're very heavy vehicles. So it being in the slower lane makes a lot more sense for them. Oh. Okay, we're getting back up to speed here. Thankfully, this won't take too long. Also, thankfully, this game doesn't emulate having to stop for food or the bathroom. I'm getting a call on my phone right now. Um, uh, sorry, one moment. That was a little weird. It was a call coming from the United Kingdom. I don't even live there. Okay. Um, make sure my wrist is okay. It's been a little back and forth. All right, I think I'm ready. Oh. I need to make sure that I'm going at least 102. If I wanted to make a song reference, I'd go for 103, but... I'm already pretty hot-blooded from, <laughs> from all the heat. It's fine just sitting here, um, especially after showering and getting all the sweat off, but it was very difficult to work earlier, and it's usually difficult to work in the summer times. Uh, but admittedly, that's when the best... Uh, that's when trees are at their best for firewood. So you need to... Or, well, I say best. That's usually when they're what I consider to be the best, which is a good size um, for what they're worth. Ideally, you would want to hold out for the tree to, uh, to grow as much as it can. So usually you would want to wait until the fall, but... I like to make sure that I'm... Oh, ooh, okay. I like to make sure that I'm uh, stocking up as much as I can throughout the year, because that way I don't have to work as hard, and it does make a stable income. I'm afraid of going into the left lane, so I keep going off the shoulder. I'm never good at staying in the lines. I'm entering Utah. Okay. The speed limit hasn't changed. Let's see. It's hard to imagine that Canada can get so warm. I mean, I understand it's not always snow and cold. <laughs> uh, but uh, at best, I kind of figured Canada would get warm enough. But it's not hot, but not cold either. Like a cool breeze at best. Well, sometimes the... Uh, I do like uh, a nice breeze while I'm working. Um, or just in general outside. Um, but it does... Oh, wow, it is 129 here. Hang on, I need to go faster. Uh, but it does get really warm here, especially in the summer times. Um, in recent years, uh, it's been getting hotter and hotter, and it's regularly up to 35 sometimes. Um, which, I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit. Um, I think 90-something? I don't actually know. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, it does get pretty hot uh, up here. Um, because of not just the humidity, um, but I do, and I do live uh, along, uh, well, not along, but near Hudson Bay. Oh, I'm going to be in trouble. I didn't mean to do this. I'm, uh, can I get let back in, please? <laughs> oh, no. I have to turn back around. Oh, no, I think I'm fine. I just didn't want to slow down. I was, oh. <laughs> I got into the conversation, I'm sorry. Uh, this is probably why I shouldn't drive in real life. Um... Uh, 
what were we talking about? I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, Minal. It's good to see you. Um, I got uh, distracted and I looked back at the screen and saw that there was a bunch of vehicles and traffic in the way. And I didn't have enough time to slow down, so instead of uh, trying, I, I just went around. I'm really glad you don't get speeding tickets in this if you're if you're going the speed limit. It did do a little bit of damage to the trailer, I guess, but that's okay. Oh, I have to turn around. All right, now I have to. Now I have to slow down. I don't know why the speed limit is 129 anyway. Oh. Maybe I should listen to my music more often. It's very calming. I did that for other people, but I guess I can calm myself down too a little bit. Oh, okay, okay. Ah, uh, yes, welcome in. Um, hello. <laughs> um, I think we were talking about the uh, the weather and how it gets pretty warm up here. Uh, it gets pretty cold in the the winter times. Um, the <laughs> uh, the uh, the temperature gets pretty bad in both directions. You have to just be ready for it. I'm built a little better for the winter. Um, that's when I grow out my uh, uh, my fur a little bit more, and that's when uh, that's actually about uh, when I lose my horns too. So or my antlers, I guess, if you want to be technical. I just like the word horns. Um, uh, but yeah, no, the, the winter time is usually a lot better uh, in general. It's easier to move around. Uh, my clothes fit a lot less snug, less sweaty, you know? <laughs> it's always easier to put on more clothes than to take them off. There we go, going 90. It says I should go 45, but unless the speed limit actually changes, I don't really feel like it, I guess. There we go. And I found Logan. He retired from the X-Men, but I found him. <laughs> Ooh, my stop is coming up. Not quite this place. The next turn. There's more American flags everywhere. Now I do need to wonder, is it a cultural thing? Why do so many uh, people have large American flags everywhere? You know where you are. There we go. Without any incident. Nothing happened. Okay, I just need to park really quickly. And then I can look at your message, I'm sorry. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> well, there's other ways to be patriotic, and you can do it without a flag, too. Maybe more people should try and fly like eagles. That'd be very patriotic, right? I think so. Okay, um... 
I still need a little bit more before I can get my next truck, so I'm going to see about getting another job. Going from uh, Logan. Maybe all Americans should just drink Red Bull then. <laughs> Ooh, Colorado. I don't think I've ever been to that, uh, that state yet. Colorado, Wyoming, and Montana. I don't think I've ever actually been to. I could go to Montana now. I think I want to do that, yeah. Make four grand or six grand. I think I'll do this one. Instead of having an American flag, you should just have a Red Bull logo. Put that on a large uh, beach towel and then hang that from your truck. Hang, hang three of them so everyone knows that you can fly. Or I, I guess it doesn't say Red Bull can make you fly. You'll just have wings. That's what it'll do. Hole in the rock. Oh. Okay, here we are. I need to make sure that I'm turning the right way. Have my signal on. Um, sorry people behind me, my, uh, my trailer is sort of crooked. I can't really control that right now. But here we go. We're going from Logan, the city that I started in at the uh, at the end of the last drop off, to the new location in Montana. I'm gonna be able to see it. I've never seen it before. Um, I've never been to uh, these states uh, in video games before. At least not in a in a realistic uh, way, like these like American Truck Simulator uh, represents. It won't be real, but it'll have the appreciative feel of the area. I do want to say how excited I am that once they're done uh, eventually making the American states, they'll start working on uh, Canadian provinces. At least that's what I've heard. It may take a few years, um, but I think it'll be okay. There we go. Um, now, unfortunately, the area that I live in, um, we, we wouldn't be able to see anyway. Because I live far from uh, any sort of highways. Uh, there's one small road that comes in from uh, Quebec, I believe. But either way, you have to... Oh, slow down. Uh, you have to... Um, uh, fly up here, I believe. At least that's what I think the uh, the humans do. I don't know for certain. very secluded part of the country. <laughs> that sign told me about a law that I can't read because I passed the sign. Oh, I'm getting close to the shoulder. I really need to stop doing that. Welcome back to Idaho. Oh. 
Okay. Now, once I start doing longer jobs, I'll have to make sure to pay attention to if I'm getting tired or running out of gas. But that won't be until I get my own truck, which is, is what I'm working towards right now. I want to make sure I'm doing it properly, though, too. So smaller jobs that make more money is, is what I'm trying to do. In addition to just going places I've never been before. But I think the, uh, the whole of the United States is about 6,000 kilometers wide. So it'll be a very harrowing um, journey regardless. Oh, there we go. It's always nice to see the environment change as you go, the different biomes, uh, to put it into uh, Minecraft terms. Because we're in somewhat of a deserty area, but it does nearby turn into uh, forests. Uh, forests of pine trees. So this is where the area is desert, but it gets cold enough that other foliage can, can grow. I keep leaning to the right, and I'm very sorry. Not sure why I'm so bad at driving today. I'm catching up to that truck in front of me, and I'm not sure how I feel about that. Yeah, look at these grass fields. It's very lovely. Oh, okay. I guess we're all pulling in for uh, for the truck stop. There we go. It's a very busy uh, truck sta way station. I'd like to go faster, please. There we go. I would just skip it, but I don't want to lose out on the, uh, on the fine. On the money that that would cost me. Very tiring day. Um, not just my work, but I also had to do a little bit of laundry as well. Which I don't really own a laundry machine, like a washer or a dryer. Uh, so I had to visit my sister's place further in the forest for that. And it's a little bit of a hike. It's not too far away, thankfully. Only about a 45 minute walk. Uh, 
Um, but I did that earlier today before it got too hot, so I'm thankful about that. Those are very sturdy traffic cones. having trouble with the lanes. Oh. Okay, I held on to forward a little too long. There we go. I'm debating if I should get more sleep or not. Oh, I found Idaho Falls. Nice. I found 7 out of 11 places in the state. Is everyone else doing okay with their, uh, with their sleep? sleep for 12 hours and still not have enough. <laughs> uh, well, sleeping for 12 hours is usually not a good sign. You usually want to sleep uh, a little less than that if you can. I'm uh, turning soon. I, I'm holding the slow down button. <sighs> okay, that was scary. It didn't feel like I'd slow down at all. Not that I don't want to sometimes just uh, stay in bed and sleep for 12 hours. I just know that it's not, uh, it's not the most good for you. Surely be in the right lane. Uh, no, generally, if you don't get enough sleep, it means that, uh, or, I'm, I'm sorry, if you spend too much time in your bed, it means that, uh, your body isn't registering that it needs to exercise. Um, and it starts shutting down things that it doesn't need. Meaning that if you ever were to want to do anything active, it would be a lot harder for you than if you had stayed um, the way you were uh, the whole time. Uh, the phrase, use it or lose it, is sort of applicable here. I don't really like it because it seems kind of aggressive, but 
In general, it means that if you're not staying active, then you lose the ability to stay active. Um, which, if you don't want to do that, then that's okay. If you don't want to be an active person, then that's, that's perfectly fine. Um, I like going outside, and I like, uh... You know, I, I like swimming, I like uh, going through the forest, I like talking um, to the, the flowers sometimes, but I enjoy uh, being able to have energy when I need it. Um, now, I've been staying up a little later recently. Well, I say recently, in the last, I guess, year. Um, just sort of um, on Twitter, which I know I shouldn't do. Uh... Just reading about the different things, and and it is very uh, depression spirally. But I don't know. I, I guess I want to stay up to date on different world events. Um, but if you spend too much time sleeping or in bed, then your body sort of turns that adapts that to your new normal. So you can't uh, be awake if you don't want to be. Or, I'm um, sorry, if you do want to be. Um, I try to get my, uh, my designated seven hours in. Honestly, that might not be enough uh, a lot of the time. I haven't recently looked up how long um, that I need to sleep for. Maybe I should. Oh, I'm very happy that it's raining for you. Um, it's not going to be raining here until, uh... Oh, I need to slow down a little bit. Slow down more. It's not going to start raining here until I believe Wednesday is when they, uh, predicted it. I can check my phone right now. Um... Let me see if I'm, uh, able to without hitting anything. Oh, I need my right hand. I forgot I didn't input finger or fingerprint imprompts. Uh, yeah, it's supposed to rain on Wednesday, uh, cooling everything in the area down to 22 degrees. <laughs> um, I try not to look at my uh, my phone while I'm driving, um, which I guess in this case would be the chat. <laughs> Uh, but it's supposed to go up to 34 tomorrow, or 34, 33 area. I'm at the hottest. Uh, but then after that it will go as high as 22, because of the rain will coming in. And I'm very thankful for that. Also, I don't have to worry too hard about using my phone while I'm driving. I'm already pretty dangerous without looking away. This area doesn't appear to be anything. It looks like it's an area you can go in and out of, but it isn't.
light markers represent highway uh, something. Okay, we're in Montana now, which is very interesting to me. I do like the uh, the trees in the area. Oh. There we go, a nice, calm drive through the town. Pick up some Aeron gasoline. Visit the gallon oil. Oh, slow down, stop, stop, please, don't hit. Oh, okay. I stopped actually where I should have. But I didn't want to slow down to stop. Yeah, they are in the way of my road. I don't appreciate all the small cars. <laughs> I'm going a little faster than I should. Okay, there we go. Welcome to Montana, the state that everyone... Well, Montana and Wyoming are the states that everyone knows as being very rural and empty and, and kind of outdoorsy. Which is good. I'm, I'm, I really like areas like that. And not just because I live in one. But uh, all the trees and all the, the hills and stuff. And it's nice and cool at night in the winter times. I wouldn't call the other cars like ants. They're a little large for ants. <laughs> Could you imagine ants the size of cars? I don't think I know anything scarier. Slow down, please. Slow down, please. Semi-sized ants would probably be pretty scary. <laughs> yeah. Um, I definitely wouldn't want to ride an ant the size of a uh, of an eighteen-wheeler. Transport ants are not what I want to to think about. <laughs> Thankfully, it's not like spiders or anything. There's a spider movie where the spider was as big as a skyscraper. Oh, that does not sound like a good time. I hope it's a horror movie and not something light or comedic. Now, if this transport weren't in front of me, I would be taking these turns a lot faster and a lot scarier. And I'd probably be fine.
Accidentally hit the V key. Um, hello? The spider put its eggs in a person and the person would explode. And out pops a giant spider. Every time it died, it got bigger. I don't understand and I'm terrified. <laughs> Driving, you risk it. Okay. I don't know how to unlock that. What does the V key do? I just meant to hit C for cruise control. I guess it solved the problem of the truck in front of me. to turn coming up soon. Oh, I need to pull over too. Oh, wait. Um, why would I need to stop? Oh, hello. Hello, Chloe. Welcome in. Um, they're making me stop at the, the way station on the left side of me. The left side of the road. I can't pull into that one. Uh, and I got distracted. Mm. Well, I've already gotten fined for it, so I don't feel the need to anymore, but... I'm not sure why they keep putting the way stations on the wrong side of the road. If they want me to pull into it, then I should... Then it should be on the side I'm driving on. I don't want to have to do a... A loop-de-loop. -loop just to... Just to make sure that... I'm being checked a third time on the same journey. Uh, but yes, Chloe, welcome in. We're in uh, Montana right now. Yeah, there is no uh, Canadian truck simulator, I'm afraid. I guess I could do 18 Wheels of Steel, but uh, that's an older game. And this one is a lot nicer to look at, I would say. But I don't mind driving uh, delivery in the United States. There's a lot more people here. They need a lot more packages. So it's a, it's a lucrative business, I would say. Headlight offense. Oh. It's still very bright out, but they want me to have my headlights on anyway. I'm trying to do my best to... Oh. I'm trying to do my best to save up for a, uh, a new truck. like when people talk in the the chill music that I put on. Um, eh. There we go. I'm almost at my destination. Um, it might be. Let me check the map.
Yep, that's the uh, the I-90 over there. Why, are you familiar with it? We're in this part of the country, by the way. In this part of Montana. Oh, is it? Oh, I wasn't aware of that. That's really cool. Um, I didn't know relative distances. I just sort of look at the road so I know which way to go. That is really cool. Um, where does it start and where does it end? Seattle to Boston, wow. That passes directly south of where I actually live. That's really interesting. I wonder how long it'll take the developers of this game to finally finish the I-90 then. Yeah, you can take the 90 east or west from here. There's a market for semi-racing. <laughs> I don't think so, but... I mean, after all, the, the, the main visual component of a transport truck is what it's transporting. Uh, so unless you just had the back and it was, uh, it was empty, then you would... Things would be fine. Can, can you not be in the way, please? I need to turn here. There we go. Now I can park it. Um, this seems fine. If there were a, a race for semi for transport trucks. I probably get first place. I'm very fast. There we go. Ooh, I got a new achievement. Perform deliveries for at least 15 different companies. Wow, that's great. Okay, so I have 168,000. Um, I think that's enough for uh, for a truck dealer. Let me take a look. Actually, wait, can I buy online? Features trusted customers only need at least three trucks before you can buy online. Well, you won't even let me see the catalog? That seems a little rude. Okay, so I have 168, meaning I have some choices. I could get this. Um, but I don't want to spend all of my money. I won't be able to change anything or upgrade or... Ch or uh, switch in different parts. 
uh, with just getting the first one I can. Though I guess this is the second one I can get. Um, I would change the color, of course. I would want something red or pink, but... Hmm. Customize the configuration. Oh, I can't even get different types of, uh... I can't even get a place to sleep in. I would need to do a few more jobs before I can actually afford to get a truck that's worthwhile. Thankfully, there's still three hours left, so I, I'll be fine. I think I was here. Um, price going down. This doesn't seem too long for a bunch of price. This seems okay, and I've never been to that high up in uh, in Idaho, I don't believe. Oh no, I have. You can see the uh, the yellow line. I'll take the job though. Twenty six grand is is enough. It's a lot for something like this. Okay, uh, one moment. All right, I think I'm ready. Okay. I didn't actually check what I was delivering. Maybe I can check um, by pausing and then going to F6. I'm delivering appliances by the look of it. Household appliances. Oh, I have three trailers. Oh, that's a lot. Um, hopefully it won't be too bad. It'll just be like a large game of Snake. Oh, um... There we go. I need the map up, otherwise I'm lost completely. I think I'm being called, but I don't know. If I stop, take a look at. Okay, I think I'm fine. I think I should just go. It's not appliances that I'm carrying, or that I'm transporting, that if they get hit by somebody else, then it just all falls to the ground and breaks. I'm not sure how much I'd appreciate something like that. Oh, you can see the yellow line I've followed before on the, uh, the mini-map. I've been through the area before.
Need to make sure that I'm not on the, the same lane as the car behind me who wants to pass. blinker on? No, it just sounds like it. I love seeing the mountains in the background. They look really good. Um, now, I do understand that uh, if this road weren't here, then we wouldn't be able to see this, but that doesn't change how good it looks by itself. Why am I only going 70? I had cruise control on. be careful about uh, the steep hill coming up. There we go. discovered Butte. <laughs> if we're mature, now's the time to now's the time to let everybody know. <laughs> How big is your Butte? You know, if I always have everyone behind me in all the lanes I'm in, then they can't ever get hit by me because I'll be ahead of them. I can never accidentally hit the side of their vehicle because I have no idea how to aim uh, or uh, to drive. There's a part of me debating to change it to. Uh, even more simplistic uh, steering, but oh, I have to pull in. But I do like the uh, the steering with the mouse option. Oh, I, I slowed down a little too soon. Usually it beeps at me, and then I have to turn in immediately, but not this time. Hope they don't mind I'm pulling three trailers behind me. It's all viewed back there. Oh, there we go. Oh, all right. Hopefully that's the only one we have to run into. 
Return to interstate. Yeah, I, I believe so. I, I will. Thank you very much. Um, I need over there. Well, maybe that's a sound that happens when a car is passing me. Here we go. And we just look at the environment around us. Um, so I'm looking, you can't really see it because it's behind the chat, but in the, uh, on, on, just, just in front of the steering wheel on the, uh, I guess the heads up display, it tells you how much gas you have, how fast you're going and a bunch of different information. It also tells you, I think, the temperature, and it says it's 86C, which I don't believe. I think it might be messing up Fahrenheit and Celsius, or it's a different um, measurement uh, entirely, but it looks like it says 86 Celsius, which is very, very insane. Yeah, that's not that's not a good amount. <laughs> um, I'm not sure it's hot enough for fire. You might need at least a hundred C for that. But yeah, that is. People definitely wouldn't be surviving in that kind of temperature. It says 84 now. At least that could be a, a 30 or maybe a 20. I don't know. It looks like an 8. I'm amused that that billboard just said the word fireworks on it, without any additional context.
I will admit that I'm having a little trouble keeping my eyes open right now. This game is very good at putting you to sleep. <laughs> Yeah, you should never drive while drowsy. Um, I learned that from the movie Cars. <laughs> Interestingly, from uh, Mac the Transporter. Which I don't remember the, the name of uh, the voice actor, but he was in uh, every Pixar movie for a while. Something Rattenberg, I believe. I'm not sure what this music is. It's scary though, I don't understand why it's playing right now. I really need to better curate my playlist. So where are we and where are we going? Oh, we're still halfway there. Still in Montana, actually. I'm going to Coeur d'Alene. And I'm going to change out this music because I do not like it. That's a little better, I guess. Um, I don't know if I need any gas anytime soon. Looks like I'll be fine for the whole trip. Would the Pixar guy be Dave? Uh, sorry for bad spelling. Rottenboro. Um, I don't know his first name. I'm very bad with names, actually. Um, maybe. He was in every early Pixar movie, I know that. He was the underminer in Incredibles. <laughs> um, if you just look up, uh, if you just credit that or Mac from uh, Cars on Wikipedia, then you should be able to get his name. I wonder how he's doing these days. I hope he's alive. I hate talking about someone and then for a while in a conversation, and then after finally looking them up, you realize they've been dead for a few years. It's always the worst. watch cars recently. I like the uh, the concept more than the execution, but that's why I like the first car so much, because in the beginning of the movie you get to see a lot more, well I guess throughout, when you're not in the town of Radiator Springs, you get to see a lot of the different uh, types of cars and different sort of highway stuff, you know? convertible. John Ratzenberg, born 1941. Oh, th thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, that sounds about right. And I'm glad he's still alive. 
I don't know if he's been in any of the more recent Pixar movies. He might have just been um, a, uh, a friend of the director that was doing the early stuff. Um, they've recently, well, I, I guess recently isn't the right word, but they pulled off of working for Pixar um, a while ago. You can bypass. Thank you very much. Um, which is why a lot of people don't like the, the newer movies. I think it was when uh, Disney decided to start paying more attention to them. Because uh, Disney had always owned Pixar, but they didn't specifically take full creative control away. Um, in the last five or so movies, um, Pixar has le had less and less say. They didn't want to do a Toy Story 4 originally. And I don't think they want to do a Toy Story 5 either. I like all of their original content, personally. Um, I did like the Toy Stories 1 and 2. I mean, I'm very excited for Inside Out 2, but... I like their original stories a lot more. Onward and uh, Soul were very, very good movies. I really enjoyed those. I mean, those are just the, the recent ones too, right? It's good to see different uh, cultural representation. Um, which actually you get to see in Brave, interestingly. You wouldn't think it, but a lot of... Uh, a lot of Celtic uh, representation isn't present in, in most movies um, and TV shows. Uh, usually if it's uh, something old-fashioned or fantasy, then sure, of course, but um, I'm going way too fast. Um, but you don't see a lot of Scottish or Irish representation uh, in a lot of different movies or TV shows nowadays. Usually it's the more... Uh, Midwestern, uh, I guess, flavor of white. <laughs> um, that's why I usually get uh, a little excited when I see uh, something like that. I like the idea um, and the lore behind things like Braveheart and 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 just Brave and. Uh, I think Song of the Sea was also in that in that sort of general cultural area. Um, just I, you see so rarely so little of it. There's a Celtic Vocaloid in the V2 series. Her name was Ivana. Oh wow! Okay, um, I'll have to look her up. That sounds very interesting. But that's why when people say that there is, uh, for representations in different, uh, IP, for different TV shows or movies, usually they have, uh, someone who's African American or, you know, Asian American or, or just, um, something you see a lot of, so, uh, the different, um, ethnic groups you would see on, say, the Power Rangers in the 90s, they're usually the, the ones that make appearances in, in shows or movies that want to have a diversity, I guess, quota. Uh, which is horrible, by the way, but... Um, it, it's sort of important to do stuff like that, to... to have at least a step away from everyone being just white American, you know? Um, but, anyway. Um, when you see uh, the quota being filled, uh, quote-unquote, uh, you don't see a lot of... Uh, different uh, ethnic groups other than that. You don't see a lot of different types of, uh, I, I guess white is how you would call it, but even the different colors, like uh, like black people, you only see um, one type of black person. You don't see different, um, I, I guess it is kind of weird to say types, um, but you don't see, uh, you know, Caribbean, you don't see people from Kenya. You just see the same, um, I, I guess, category of the same diversity 
in any place that any movie adds diversity to. It would be nice to get um, new and different uh, types of diversity, you know? Like, Encanto was a very good movie. I, I loved it. Um, and not just because of what I'm talking about. It, it was also just a very good movie. But it's, I believe, a step in the right direction. Oh, I gotta... I have to turn here. Oh, this is the end of the journey. Oh, I didn't even realize. We're about to make 26 grand. turn too quickly now. Okay, right back there seems good. Oh. I think that jingle means it's not the, the phone, but um, that my trailer is getting too close to something or other. $26,000. I'm getting close to level 10 now. Oh, excellent. Um, I guess just in time delivery. Important delivery is unlocked. Urgent. I don't want to focus too hard on things that need uh, to be timely. Because I'm very bad about that. <sighs> okay, one more and then I promise I'll get my... Uh, I get my new truck. Comedian. In every accident I was in, I kept hearing this beeping sound. Then crash trying to figure out. <laughs> That's funny. Um, I, I really like that. Oh, uh, hey. Welcome in. Thanks for the follow. I should really move that alert over somewhere else so it's not in the way. Thanks for the follow. Iron Ace War. Yeah, welcome into the channel. I'm very glad to have you. Okay, um, I don't know where I ended up. Thank you. Um, I need to change the sound, but I really like the idea of having a forest-related, um, series of alerts. Uh, price per distance would be a lot better, I think. Then again, I've never actually been to Wyoming before. So this should be fun. I'm going to take this job. It is Hazard Class 1 and it's Standard. Articulated trailer. Okay, it looks like I'm delivering dynamite, which is, um, scary. 
Um, I need to be careful or everything will explode. Uh, no smoking around my truck, please. I wonder if I'll be able to hit my follower goal today. Okay. Um, I'm not sure how exactly I'm supposed to get through. I think this is how we, we were supposed to do it. Okay, I need to turn here. Now, I've been on this road before, but only to deliver to actually where I just pulled out of. So it's going to be a new experience for me. And not to put too fine a point on it, but I do have dynamite. Uh, the truck doesn't seem to be as full as it could be, so I think I'll have to be empty. I think I'll have to stop for gas at some point. Oh, I'm sorry. Please. Oh. oh, I barely touched you. That doesn't count. After this delivery, before I get my new truck, I am going to get a drink. It still is quite warm in my room. Oh, could you move, please? Thank you. I just don't want to run a red light. Oh, well, there's one. I, st I stopped perfectly at the line. I feel very good about that. need to pause and uh, adjust something. Okay. There we go. Hopefully I don't run into the next red light too. But it seems as if I will anyway, so that's unfortunate. I guess this is why I don't drive through the cities very often. I like the open road where I don't have to stop every 25 seconds because of a new red light. I'm sure it'd be fine if I were in a car, uh, but being in a truck just feels very confining. I guess it is fitting though. Um, being very large in a small space not fit for you. Um, I am sort of used to that, I guess. There we go, I'm turning here. Large American flag. 
I'm not sure why we're listening to someone tune a guitar right now. It's fine, I suppose. Oh, we're about to go up a mountain. Logan River. Oh. There we go. No faster than this. I still need to make it up the hill. If I ram the mountain fast enough, then the dynamite will explode and I will be carving a new tunnel. It'll just blow through the entire mountain. It, the, the, the road workers will thank me for all of my hard work. I'm not sure I like this very much. Hopefully this is better. It does feel a little better. It's a rest stop in a in a half mile. Now if I needed to sleep, I'd probably sleep right there, yeah. Looks like though I need to go back and forth a little bit. I think this might be downhill, otherwise the road would be straight. Yeah, it's downhill. Usually when it goes back and forth like that, it's either downhill or uphill. Because they weren't able to make a, a straight road through the area. Garden City. Okay, large turns, but I think I'm fine with that. Oh, please stop, please stop, please stop. Oh, thank you for pulling ahead slightly. I was afraid I'd hit you and lose a thousand dollars. Lake Town and Keminer, I believe. Somebody's having construction work done on their front lawn. Oh wow, look at this area. Imagine getting to live in a place like this. Just having your house right beside an open field to uh, a hilly environment nearby. It'd take five to ten uh, minutes to walk there, but you could go uh, tobogganing in the winter. Or GTing, that'd be, that'd be a lot of fun.
Lake Town, make sure you're going slower than the than the maximum speed limit. My right shoulder is really bugging me today. I'm not sure why. Maybe I should have wore a different bra today, I don't know. Oh, okay, I was wondering why you kept opening and closing Aura Kingdom. <laughs> So what's Aura Kingdom? I'm not sure I've ever heard of it before. Oh, it's becoming nighttime. Um, flights. Flights. No, it's not nighttime. It's just, it's just cloudy. It's an M&O, I really... Okay, well, I'm very glad to hear that. I'm sorry it won't open. I'm uh, going too slow for this environment. Welcome to Wyoming. Oh. Basically, it's to save the world from darkness while using an ancient connection with Gaia. Okay. Oh! No, I'm... I take wide turns. You can't be like that. I'm sorry. You can't be right there. the person in that car is, is is okay. Please pull in. I can do that. Um, oh, it's in here. Oh, interesting. It's in the same area as a rest stop. I've never uh, seen one like this. I guess they have a lot more physical space to, to build one. Non-perfect technical state. Be more careful next time. I'm very sorry. Um, it was F7. Yeah, it's... I had a, a rough patch hitting a car in the way in. Um, I do need to give credit where it's due. Um, when I was pulling into this truck stop... Or, I, I guess, uh, way station. Um, uh, what I saw was not just an American flag, but also, uh, also a Wyoming flag. Um, the only reason I recognize it is because recently I saw a video on, uh, state flags by uh, CGP uh, Gray, I think is, is the uh, name of the channel. It's a very good video. It, it represents um, good flag design, I, I would think. Um, it makes me think about the Ontario flag and how it's just not very good at all. It might have once been okay, but it's just not very good uh, anymore. Uh, but thankfully, it's uh, bad in a very different way than you see in a lot of uh, American states, where it's just a blue background with a uh, with something on it. Usually, their crest. Uh, 
unfortunately, uh, the Ontario flag is bad in that it's, uh, it's just very red with a Union Jack in the left corner, and then the, uh, and then the crest on the right side. It's almost, it's actually almost identical to Manitoba, uh, which is unfortunate. I don't know the history of why, but it is just not very good in general. I wish it were better, you know? Maybe they would, uh... Maybe we could get a moose on it, you know? Looks like they have a convoy to the left. <laughs> I'm glad you're enjoying the rain. I love the rain myself. Wish it would rain more often, keep it cooler in the area. Um, thankfully, or maybe not thankfully, um, it rains, uh, commonly, but not, uh, too regularly. So that way it doesn't get too, uh, wet in the area. Oh, I need to slow down a bit. Little America? I thought we were already in America. <laughs> I feel like a place shouldn't be called Little America if it's already in the United States. Rain is awesome, and the lightning is the coolest way to clean off. Or clean the air. I'm not sure you would want to get hit by lightning to clean yourself off. <laughs> it is a good way to clean the air. Usually, uh, right before a thunderstorm, you can feel uh, pressure from it. Look at the area. Oh, we're about to go into a tunnel. There we go. Oh, it was a small tunnel. Okay. I thought it'd be a little longer. But still, it's nice to see. And nice to look through and see what's going on. Um, do I need to get gas anytime soon? If I need to get it anywhere, it'd probably be here or here. Not where I currently am. I'm pulling up into Rock Springs right now. Um, but that's okay. Wyoming is very nice to look at. I do love the environment, all the different scenery, the, uh, uh, the hills and, uh, the, the, the rolling fields. I understand why everybody says that it's a nice place to retire to. Not that I'm old enough to think about retirement, <laughs> but, uh, if I ever decide to live anywhere other than, um, the forest, it would be nice to live in places like this. I discovered Rock Springs. There's a Walbert, um, uh, convenience store there.
Looks like we'll be driving into the night, though. Ooh, and it's steak night. Gonna go stand in the rain. All right, well, enjoy the rain for me, please. Uh, and please send it as, as much east as you can. <laughs> The sooner we get rain here, the, the sooner it won't be so hot anymore. Then again, it is a lot cooler now than it was earlier today, so I'm thankful for that. I can actually check the temperature right now on my phone. No, okay, it was just a placebo effect. It's still 28. It was uh, up to 30 earlier, but that was while I was out. Um, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't, um, it wasn't 30 when I was, uh, after I'd already come in. It was 28 by the time I started the stream. It's nighttime now, so everybody feel free to relax and rest if you need it. Oh, I shouldn't let go of the wheel like that. There we go, I have my high beams on. So it should be a lot uh, easier to see. I don't really need them yet, it's only 9 p.m., but. You can see the beginnings of stars out in the, uh, the horizon. It's very empty out in this part of the, the countryside. Is everyone having a good day? Um, I know I don't uh, expect anyone to talk if they don't want to. That is part of what I want to set as a precedent. But, I mean, if, if you want to talk to me, then I am, I'm okay to answer questions or just, just chat. Um, I, I feel self-conscious always talking about myself. I guess I should get used to it, but I just it's, it's really difficult to. Oh, the truck stop is on the other side. Okay. I was wondering how that would go. Oh. Respect the wildlife. Yes. <laughs> That was what looked like a caribou on that uh, sign. But they are cousins, so... I, I like, uh, biologically. Not like familiarly. I do have cousins and they are other moose, but... Not many. My mother only had uh, one other sibling.
I feel bad going so slowly when the speed limit is 121. I see by going up to 105 or 110, and then I'll put it on. I'll uh, put it on cruise control. It's very difficult right now, though. It seems to be staying around 95. There we go. Oh, also, I am getting a, uh, a personal message on Discord, so one moment. Okay, hopefully things are resolved there. Becker coming up on Sinclair, which I believe is the area we need to uh, pull into. Um, oh no, we're going to uh, Laramie. This is the last gas station in a while before there. But it's only 60 kilometers, so I should be able to handle it. I'm not sure why you can hear a frog uh, chirping right now. I'm, there must be one in the cabin. Oh. I should look more at the... at what I'm doing than at OBS. Watch the road, not your, your streaming program. Hey, Catbag, how are you doing? I'm getting close to my delivery here. Oh, please don't hit the truck. <sighs> um, I'm doing okay. Um, I'm just, after this delivery, going to have enough to get my own truck now. Uh, but after, uh, before that, I'm going to get something to drink and, uh, and hopefully switch my clothes a bit, because my shoulder is bothering me. 
I think I put on the wrong bra earlier. Oh, it's a yellow light. Um, currently I'm hauling dynamite, which is why I'm uh, a little afraid that if I hit anything, I will die. And also, I'm sitting here at this red light, um, forever, which is, uh, which is his own thing. I'm one away from getting to my follower goal, which is really exciting. Um, and then ten more away from fi affiliate. Oh, I, uh, didn't know my, my wheel was turned like that. Currently in Wyoming, which I've, I'm discovering is very beautiful countryside. Um, if I weren't predisposed to the forest, then I'd probably want to live there myself. Oh, going too fast. I'm not sure why you don't hear a lot. It is, uh, so far it's been the, one of the nicer looking places. Um, and just generally that part of, uh, the American Midwest, or I, I guess Northwest, is very nice. I need to turn here, though. Thankfully the dynamite got here in one piece. There we go. Where would you like this? Oh, just in front of me, huh? Okay. That's fine. Oh. I'm not properly parked. Hang on. I need to bring it all the way around. Nope, this isn't gonna work. Oh, never, nothing is good. Um, I can't, it won't let me try to park anymore. Oh, that's a hill. I can't... Well, this is just not good. Um... <sighs> I'm hoping that none of it explodes in the meantime. Oh, if you're gonna start moving. Please don't hit the other trailer. Okay. Oh, I didn't think I was hitting anything, but it looked like I, I guess I did.
Yes, I would like to do that, please. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Yeah, it was it was uh, really good. <laughs> um, okay, so if I take a look at my career, um, delivery log. Yeah, I, I delivered uh, dynamite. Well, I've delivered dynamite in the past, apparently. On day six. The most money I ever made at once until uh, I did it again. <laughs> um, but I do want to uh, get my own truck. Truck dealers. I've only encountered two in my time. I uh, go to selected dealer. So I have $218,000 now. That means I have a few options. Realistically, I would want nothing above this one. This one seems like a good one to me. But I only have 16 grand uh, available from level 13. Oh, I can't even buy it because it's too high level. I didn't even realize. Okay, I guess this is the one I would be doing. It does give me a lot more wiggle room for uh, getting different upgraded parts. Oh no, I wanted to customize that. Can I undo that? Ah. Alright, well I bought that. That is mine now. There was no customization. It was, it was exactly as it was. If you ever want to feel like an idiot. <laughs> okay. Welcome to my truck headquarters. Oh, it looks good. I think I'm in, uh, I think I'm, uh, in Seattle. I don't remember which city I put my headquarters into. I've been all over the map since. Okay. Alright, now I can hit escape. Yes. I can upgrade my truck, which is what I wanted to do to begin with. Level 9 items. Trailer upgrades? I don't really want to do wheels. I want to do... Um... Diagnostics? No, that's not right. Everything is fine right now. I wanted to customize it. Reposition your driver's seat and steering wheel for maximum comfort. Set up mirrors and track your surroundings better. Configure lights installed on your truck. Parking lights. Low beam, high beam, and beacon. Front auxiliary and roof auxiliary. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, hello. Uh, welcome in, uh, Ultimate Yellow. Uh, the trucking is good. I just accidentally purchased a truck without uh, without customizing it in any way, which makes me feel very dumb. Um, I wanted to paint it, and I wanted to do different things. Trailer truck upgrades. Near a shop, I guess. Oh, I have to physically go there. Well, it's, new it's not too far away. Uh, thankfully. 
Uh, but I also did want to get a drink because it's been uh, very warm in my room right now. Uh, so I will um, be back in, in a few minutes. Thank you everyone for stopping in. And I hope you enjoyed the stream uh, so far. Okay, I have my drink now. I think I'm uh, I think I'm doing a little better. It's been very warm today in particular. Um, and tomorrow uh, it will be uh, a little bit warmer. It will go up to 33, um, which which is Celsius for uh, for anyone from the US. Um, but um, I'm doing a lot better now that I've gotten something to drink in, in this in this warm cabin that I live in. Okay. <clears throat> Need to back up and hopefully not do too much damage to my truck. I also need to pay attention because now it's uh, a lot easier to go a lot faster, a lot quicker. Okay, here we go. Hopefully going to the dealership means I can uh, paint my truck or, uh, or change out different items.
Oh, going too fast here. Things should be really good now that I have my own vehicle. I can customize it as I will, and I can uh, get different uh, things that I wish for. Oh, I chose the wrong uh, exit. I've never been a really big fan of these different uh, interchanges that just change in seven different directions. The kinds you see at airports all the time. It makes driving around in them very confusing. Not not that I do a lot of real life driving, but um, when when I'm out with uh, with other people. Found a hiring agency though. And that looks like a dealership to me. Yeah, I'm gonna see about what I can uh what I can do here. Um, enter. Okay, I would like to customize um, my truck, please. Um, Um, what's the, uh, the difference in, in the information? Oh, it says over here. Okay. Oh, it's only available from level 10. All right. Um, yeah, something really good about heavy cargo would be great. Doesn't need to be... Too much. Something like this would be great, yeah. Trade in value. Oh I'm oh I'm just getting a new truck entirely. Oh, I don't really want to do that. Is that how this works? Um no, I don't want to leave the... I don't know how any of this works. How do you get your own... How do you customize your truck? Paint. Here we go. Custom color. Save colors preset, apply color preset. I'd like to confirm this color, please. Oh wait, I can get different designs. Then again, these are very expensive. This looks very good, but I'm not sure I would specifically want this. We need to get something that's striped, uh, so that I can change the colors to plaid. I guess this works. Depending on which angle you look at it from.
Oh, but that's a lot more than just the custom color. Get a dark red metallic, which is basically what I was setting anyway. I can't afford to tr customize my own truck. I don't even know how to do that. Um, does anyone know how to do that? I might have to look it up. Um, alt tab. American truck simulator. Um, truck customizing customization. Here we go. No, it's okay. I'm looking it up now. Someone says they'll customize my truck on Fiverr. Um, how to customize your truck after buying one. Uh, customize you can do when buying the truck, but you can only go into repair station to do that if you want. As you level up, you gain new things. The truck you're driving can only be altered when you're parked on the truck service stations icon. Oh, I have to go to... Okay. So I have to go to a, uh, a service station or like a repair area. There we go. Um, so I'm going to exit here. I don't want to go to a dealership. I want to go to that service station over there. This. Uh, enter. Truck maintenance. Truck configurator. Oh, there we go. Perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Um, I can't get a different cab. Um... I would like to get this. Confirm the order. See the order. Um, the clear the order. Oh no, um, I don't. I guess that's what it's going to look like. It'll be worse for normal cargo, which I'm not fully sure I understand. Hill traversal will be better. Oh. It's not compatible. Um, install it needs to be removed. Would you like to remove it? No. I'm just I'm just looking. Okay, so there's a an icon at the bottom there. So I can't do these because they don't fit well. This engine isn't the best at heavy traversal, but it's better at normal cargo, which I'm not sure what the difference is. I'm going to stick with that. Look at the uh, the transmission. Okay, so this will be a lot better in general. I think this is the best option here. Get the interior. Oh, I can't change it though, unfortunately. I'll have to do something different at level 10. Oh, hey, welcome in, new follower. Hey, I reached my follower goal, thank you very much. Uh, Yoshi Trucking, I'm very glad to have you. Um. Hey! Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, I need to set a new follower goal now. Manage my goal. Um, start a new goal. Yeah, set it to... Help me get to affiliate. Yes, thank you very much. There we go. I'm not sure why there's an alert for I have a new goal. I, I, I guess in case I get lazy. 
thank you very much, uh, Yoshi Trucking. I hope you enjoy the uh, the very trucking stream that I'm doing. Um, I'm not sure doing uh, this level of paint job is worth it. That'd be a lot of extra cash. I think I'll just go with the, the, uh, the custom metallic color. have red that looks black from different angles. Okay, and then accessories. Choose a pin on the truck. Oh, very interesting. Cab doors. Oh, there's a lot of different customization, I didn't realize. Tank. Have a larger gas tank would be really good. What is this? Side skirts? Ooh, okay. That does look very nice. Cabin deflectors. Oh, no. No, thank you. Um, remove, please. There we go. Beacon. <laughs> no, I don't think I want to have that either. Main mirrors, yes. That looks very nice. Hood. Oh, there's only uh, one option for that. A standard plate. Need to make sure if I hit anything that my truck is protected. I don't see much difference for that, so I'm not going to mess with it. No, I don't I don't think I want that. Thank you, though. Oh, it's the same thing, but on the other side. Main mirrors, beacon, handrail. Oh, I guess we're getting in. What is this? Side deflectors. Oh, interesting. Okay. I guess that's fine. Mud guards. Standard or chrome? I think standard works better for that. Mud flaps. Exclusive or exclusive white. I think I'll keep it standard for now. Tire. It seems to be the same regardless. I don't see it changing performance very much. Only this item may revert some connected parts and accessories. I think this is okay. I think this is good for, for my truck. My very first truck that's mine. Air filters. Oh, there's no other options. Okay. Um, accessories. 
inside the cabin. Co-driver's seat. Oh, can I just have it removed? Safety window. That seems okay. I see no difference between those. Front mirrors, steering wheel. Oh, there's a lot of different options. Ooh, I don't really like that very much. I kind of like this one a lot, actually. There we go. This is the one I want. Um, front mirror accessory slot. Oh, very interesting. Front mirror. I think the accessory slot would be really good here on the left side. I'm not entirely sure what it is, but it may or may not help me um, with steering. Front mirror. Driver's plate. Am I able to customize it? Oh, yes. Excellent. Um, fawn. Though I guess, um, I guess only four letters isn't a lot. Flannel. There we go. <laughs> oh, that's, I love that. That's so good. Alright, I've now customized my truck. It's ready for the road. I need to go find a find a job. Okay. Now that I have my truck, which looks so good, I need to go find freight market. Earn money for your company using your own truck. Load the freight and deliver it safe and sound. Complete World of Trucks delivery contract using your own equipment. A record of these deliveries is stored in your World of Trucks profile? I don't know what a World of Trucks profile is. I'm just going to go to the freight market for now. Things from Seattle. Um, just something simple for my first uh, first delivery. I could deliver three trucks with my new truck. <laughs> okay, I really want to do that. Um, optimized for heavy cargo. Yes, I wanted to be uh, extra ready for extra for heavy cargo. Continue. Oh, I didn't. Um, I didn't actually set, I didn't set it on GPS. That one. Set GPS to nearest. I don't know where I'm going. I didn't properly listen uh, to when I was getting uh, the job. Price per distance from Seattle only, please.
this one. Where is this? I think I'm here, actually. I guess maybe I'm already here. I'm already at the chems. I guess this is where I need to, to get the job. Yeah, this is the one. I would like to take this job, please. Trailer's ready. Proceed to the loading area. In the back. Okay. Oh. It's difficult to see. I don't really know how to get to the back from here. It says the service entrance is back here, so... Oh, I have to... Okay. I have to back up now. Um, hmm. Not sure how much I like having to back up. Thankfully, I have rear view mirrors. Oh. Going the slightly wrong way. There we go. Perfect. I think I'm ready to begin. This is where the game officially begins, right? <laughs> it was a three-week tutorial, but I think I'm finally ready. And now I know when I'm roughly driving straight thanks to the bobble on my wheel. Maybe I shouldn't have put the plate here. It's, it makes it harder to see the line in front of me. But this is my truck. I'm really excited that I have it now. Once I hit level 10, a lot of uh, customization options will open up for me. supposed to pull through? Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. So I go right or left? I go right. I'm going south from here. I'm not sure how much I like this uh, driver's plate in my in my window. It makes it difficult to see the road. I 
Maybe I'll get used to it. But I have my new truck, and I'm delivering three other trucks uh, through down the road, which feels very funny to me. There's a way station in a mile. Hopefully I can bypass it. Oh, no, I have to have to pull in. Okay, thankfully it's on this side of the road. Too far. There we go. Whew. All right. Need to get up to the speed of everyone else. Because the speed limit is 97, so I need to be sure I'm going that quick. Oh, also, I need to switch lanes here. There we go, I finally have my own truck. Um, and now sleeping is something I need to concern myself with, unfortunately. Oh. Uh, but it does mean that um, everything I do is, is, is my money. I earn every dollar that I make now. I'm very excited about that. There's nothing quite as freeing as working for your own money. No bills added on, no we're paying for uh, this or that. Every dollar is yours. It's always very freeing to, to have a job like that. I need to get to the next lane. Can you please hurry up? Thank you. Oh, all right. Hey, welcome back in. Um, I finally got my own truck. I saved up for it, I customized it, so now it's all red. Um, I got this little bobble on the steering wheel that tells me um, if I'm driving straight line or not. Um, and I have to actually pick up the, uh, the cargo instead of just having it already connected. Which means I will have to get better at going in reverse, but I think I'm fine about that. Thank you very much. Oh, uh oh. Um, can I get through here? No, I can't. Okay. I didn't want to go around. Now I have to go fix my new truck. I hate when that happens. <laughs> oh, I know I'm already at 43, thank you. Please just let me through. 
Thank you very much. I need to go this direction, and you're in my way. Maybe now that it's my truck, I'll worry about going the actual direction that I need to. Um, but first, I need to stop in at a service station. And, and fix everything that I just broke. Hopefully it doesn't cost more than I can't believe I spent this long driving so many trucks only to the instant I get my own screw up that badly. Yeah. I know, I'm going there now. I'm not sure when they expect this job to get here. Um... <laughs> thank you. Um, I'm not sure when they expect the, uh, the cargo to actually arrive. Or rather, when they want it. Turn here. All right, now where is the service station? Oh, it's in the back over there, okay. All right. Need to fix my truck as soon as you can, please. There we go. Um, that's a lot more expensive than I can afford. Oh, I have coin insurance. Not sure what that means, but if it only costs 3000 then that's fine. That's great, actually. I need to be extra careful not to do the same thing over again, though. Now, do I need to sleep anywhere? Oh, I don't. I don't believe so. Not before I get to the uh, to the place down there. I'm not sure if the blue bar getting to the top or getting to the bottom means it's full. Oh, there we go. Things seem to have worked out well. So what if the instant I got my first truck, I, I crashed it and did half damage to it? I think it'll be fine. I think I'll be okay.
But now we're off to, uh... Now we're off to, to where we need to go. There we go. Back on the back on the highway. I think the sleep bar being the the bed icon being full blue means that that is uh, that I'm not tired. I think that's what that means. Because the icon beside it, the gas icon. Oh no, please, please no, please no. Uh, the icon, um, when it gets to the bottom for gas, is when it, uh, when I'm empty. So I'm thinking the bed icon being at the bottom is when I'm tired. Okay, I guess I'm going this way. Um, I don't want to try going around anymore. Oh, I can still go forward, though. I need to get through. These trucks need a truck to deliver them. Are we getting... I think we're moving now. You need to get in, please. Thank you very much for letting me in. <sighs> okay. I sort of wish I could go a little faster, but I think it's fine. There we go. It is a little unfortunate that I've already been down this uh, stretch of highway before. I do want to prioritize um, going ways I've never been before. But I think this is okay. Okay, I guess the uh, the bed icon being at the top means I'm getting close to full. Um, I've already passed all of the bed icons. Unfortunately. Uh, the closest one would be here, and I might as well do the job if I'm going to do that. Which is unfortunate, because I am at my limit here. Oh, I'm going too fast. There we go. Slightly faster than everyone else around me. Meaning they will never overtake me.
Okay, maybe I should stop for a, for a rest stop. It is right there is the problem. And also we're getting another uh, truck dealership right here. I'm just, I'm yawning, which is why I'm, I'm concerned. Oh, I should probably... Oh, I'm going on the other side. Okay. I need to make sure that I'm not going too quickly on these turns here. So I don't break anything. Oh, too, I slowed down too quickly. Uh, yawning in the game. Um... So the bed icon beside the, the, on the sat nav to the right, you see it's fully blue. See, for a moment I thought when it was uh, full, that, that means I was fully rested. But it means that I need to find somewhere to sleep soon, or my character's eyes will start closing, which is bad. That means I'll, the game will still be moving, but I won't be able to see what I'm doing. And you can hear her sort of getting tired. Yeah, now the icon is red, actually, which is very bad. Um, I need to finish this delivery and then get to a rest stop. And thankfully, I know where one is. It's, it's really close to here, which I'm very thankful for. Uh, but it means I can't grab a new job until I... Um, until I sleep. Which I guess makes sense. That's fine. Oh, I can go now. It's only another 15 kilometers away. But these Kensworth trucks needed to be brought to another Kensworth. Thankfully, um, I may be a little tired, but I'm fine overall. Uh, in, in real life, anyway. Uh, so I, I'm not too worried about that. I think I'll sleep soundly tonight. I usually do after stream nights. I'm getting tired. I should find a parking spot to, to rest. Yeah, so you see the, uh, the corners of the screen are getting darker. Oh. I need to turn here. There's my destination. Oh. You would like it right there. Okay, well I can do that. Thankfully it's not too difficult. It does mean I need to be a little bit more creative with my, uh, with my parking. Right there is, is where you want it. It was satisfactory. A damage penalty, right, because I did run into some stuff. Okay, so I need to go back into the, the world. Because I need to go find a... Oh, I can sleep here, actually. Okay, that works perfectly. Where and how? It's somewhere in the corner to the left. Okay, I can rest here. Thank thank God. Oh, alright.
There we go. Now I need to find a, uh, a job on the market. From where I currently am. Vancouver, I guess. No really price jobs from there. What about Portland? Oh, these are a lot better jobs, I would say, uh, price-wise. Offer expires in 42 hours. So that seems okay. Yeah, you want me to go there. All right. Set G G GPS as destination. I forgot for a moment that I'm not actually hauling anything right now. Oh, I, I forgot um, how much it, how quickly I stop. Thankfully, I'm right beside where I need to be. I forgot how quickly I stop. I need to not hold. I need to feather the the stop a little bit harder. Okay, freight market. It's a high value cargo. Um, I suppose. I'd like to take this job, please. Trucks, tanks are refilled and driving. Oh, right. This is one of those ones that has, uh... Um, uh... I, I, I forget the word. Um, where they, uh, chaperone me. I'm delivering a boat, which is... Some sort of weird publicity stunt, I guess. Okay, pay extra attention to the following. Um, avoid any possible contact with the escort vehicles and keep the cargo between them. Do not drive out of the estimated route, uh, nor to filling stations, rest stops, etc. Obey speed limitations, which will be ensured by the front escort vehicle. Um, watch out for the overtaking traffic and the other drivers on the roads. Change lane maneuver. Back goes first, then the front, then me. Mm-hmm. You need to be extra careful when you're delivering a boat, I guess. It's always a little more nerve-wracking um, when there's a uh, escort. That's what the, the term was, like a police escort. Oh. Oh no. Maybe Sherlock could help.
I didn't even make it out of the business yet. Oh, I don't like when this stuff sort of thing happens. Caught on the street light. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I don't know how to get out of this situation. Other than just have enough leverage, I guess, when I'm driving. <sighs> okay. Um, I eventually made it out. Hopefully you don't mind that the boat has scratched a little bit. Okay, I need to figure out how to properly turn. Like so. There we go. Now I just need to follow this police car the entire drive. It's going to be 400 kilometers of this, so I hope you're ready. <laughs> it's a very heavy boat. I guess I don't need to, to care about the, the traffic lights. Which, thankfully for that. Okay, I didn't know if my lights were on. I basically just need to make sure that this car in front of me is in the same lane as me. That's all I need to pay attention to. I need to go no faster than the car in front of me um, and make sure that it is in the lane that I'm in. That's that's all I need to focus on. Uh, for 350 kilometers, which is a lot. Oh, slow down. Not, not by that much. Okay, here we go. Turning right. It's a very difficult maneuver with such a wide load behind me. Ooh, okay. Turning right again. Oh, don't know what's happening. Okay. Didn't turn wide enough. Even though I almost hit oncoming traffic. Trailer damage? From what? Well, I guess I am dragging it slightly. Scraping it along the, uh, the ridge there. Once we get on under the highway, it should be a lot easier. I'm experiencing some weird lag right now, though. Texas size journey awaits you. Oh, very interesting. Okay, we're going up the, uh, the overpass ramp now. Uh, I'm struggling. Might have also been from when you were stuck on the streetlight. Well, <laughs> um, 
Maybe. Oh, I'm slowing down a little too much because of the, uh, the weight of the cargo. <sighs> okay, all right. I think I'm ready to go. I think I'm doing very well right now. I've had to hold my uh, my finger on the W key the whole time though, which I'm not. Uh, I don't really doesn't feel good to do so. Okay, now I'm going a little bit over the speed limit. Right. No, right there. Perfect. Cruise control on. Now I don't have to worry about my speed anymore. Unless we're turning, I guess. I'm not sure why I'm hearing an alarm go off. Oh, uh oh. Um, please don't run into the police officer. Oh, okay. All right, now we're now we're all set. Eventually, when I customize my truck enough uh, to the level I want it, um, and this will require me being uh, higher level, of course, um, when I get to that point, I'm going to uh, I'm going to start hiring drivers to work for me, which I think is the idea. I think that's what I what you would want. The game is moving very slowly right now, and I'm not sure what to do about that. Hopefully the stream is going okay. It isn't cutting out or, or, or looks bad quality-wise. Hopefully things are fine. Oh. We have people on the bridge overlooking what's going on. I wonder if this is a famous person's boat. They probably have their own truck company they hire though, so maybe... Maybe not. I don't know what sort of circumstance would lead to... me needing a police escort for this boat. Maybe it's the heat, I don't know. Seems an odd thing to do just for because it's warm. I'm going a little too fast. Lane change maneuver is happening soon. I 
Oh, you've stopped entirely. Why? I guess you wanted to go to the left. That's okay, I guess. We're about halfway to where we need to go. I'm according to the map, which I'm zoomed a little too far in for. Yeah, we're going to Newport. Which I've heard of Newport Beach. That's uh, something I've heard in uh, a movie or a television show. I thought it was something on the East Coast, though. I don't actually know much about American cities or locations. Just what I've heard from other places. There we go. Now if I uh, start speeding up too much, I still won't go over the speed limit. And we'll, it will be less likely that I'll hit the uh, the police car in front of me. Okay, that was it. That was a real life yawn. Um, but my back is bothering me a little bit from uh, from sitting like this the whole time. It was bothering me a little bit earlier, but when I got my drink, I uh, I changed clothes and it and it did help a little bit, just sort of adjusting. Um, thankfully, I'm doing okay. Um, and when the stream is over. In half an hour, I'll be able to open my window and it will be uh, 22 degrees. And it will rapidly get cooler as the night goes on. I'll be very thankful for that. Fast point storage. It's non-stop. If you ever need to store your storage items forever, non-stop, that's the place to go. They don't ever stop storing things for you. If you have a couch you can't have fit in your apartment, they'll hold it forever. You can't get it back. It's, it's theirs now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Now we turn here. This is so very nerve-wracking. And for reasons unknown, it feels very slowed down. Oh. What did I get caught on? boat is caught. <sighs> it's caught on that sign there.
I don't know how to fix this. Trying to back up now. <sighs> Going forward. Nope, it's still not. Hmm. I know I'm moving to the rear escort. I'm stuck. Oh, I, I unstuck it. Okay. We got it. Everyone, we got it. We made it out. It's really difficult to avoid stuff like that when it's so far back and so wide. I need to just drive over here first before I can even think about turning. Oh, all right. That was very stressful, but we made it. That's the second time that's happened with this boat. I'm not I'm not I don't like this boat. If I ever do high value again, I'm hoping it's something that isn't wide. Long is fine, but not wide. Um, there we go. I had my differentials on. Which I think means that you can have more horsepower or something. I don't know fully what that means. If someone else knows, I'd be I'd be very happy to to uh, hear an explanation. For now I should focus on driving closer to the left line. Not too close, mind you, just close enough that I don't get caught on anything. Careful. There's it is it is a very large boat and it likes to get caught on things. Oh, okay. Uh, to whoever is watching right now, I'd just like to say thank you very much for being here. Um and for being a part of my uh, streaming experience. It's been an amazing journey so far and I'm very excited that I've gotten this far. Um I'll be ending in about half an hour. Um, maybe I'll go a little bit later. I am getting a, a little better, I think. Um, but next time I'm on, I'll be doing uh, more House Flipper on Wednesday. Thank you very much, Tab. Right, this is a very comfortable driving pace, I would say. Welcome back. Welcome back, Minnow. Um, I got my own truck. I'm not sure if you were there for that. <laughs> I was able to purchase and customize my own truck, which I'm very, very happy about. Um, 
Um, I'm currently delivering a boat, which loves to get stuck on everything. Oh, uh oh. Okay, good, we're not turning. Okay. Uh, how was the rain? Did you enjoy it? <laughs> I'm very glad to hear that. Sometimes you just have to... <laughs> Sometimes you just have to go outside and let the rain fall on you. You have to let the rain fall down. Oh, a felled tree. Oh, wow. I didn't know they programmed in stuff like that. I wonder if that's just part of the environment or if that's uh, an event. <laughs> well, if I see you open the game more than once, then I'll know it didn't. Okay, we're turning left up, coming up soon. Alright, I need to make as wide a turn as possible here. Okay. I think that worked. I need to be careful not to get caught on things on the left side. Or on the right side. Like that. Exactly like that. Look, I don't have a lot of clearance room. I need to back up or I won't be able to fix what I've done. <sighs> it isn't even stuck. I should just be able to go. How am I supposed to get out if I can't even leave? It's not even stuck on anything, it's just deciding to be here. I'm staying in the left side lane, I don't care what you think. I have to be in the middle of the street, otherwise it won't work. This boat is too big to be in your lane. Oh, how was, uh, how was goat's milk? I hear it's very good, uh, in general. It's a very good source of nutrients.
Oh, I can go faster now. Good. It's very slow right now. Tap your speed to avoid possible crash. I'm not sure where we're going exactly. Oh, you're going here. Good. I was already here. Thankfully. Um, oh, right. It was interesting. Definitely different cows for sure, but not bad, just interesting. I don't want to be in super uh, semi bumper cars, you know. I don't want, I don't want that very much at all. I'm tired of it getting caught. Thankfully it's coming up uh, soon that we'll be we'll be out of this area. Need to be as far to the left as possible to avoid getting caught on the right side. Okay, it looks like thankfully we're going to be turning here. The, the sat nav is confusing me a little bit. I need to make sure it's as wide a turn as possible. There we go. I think that's okay. Make sure not to get caught on anything else. Drive close to the yellow line. Partially on it, maybe partially across it. Oh, I'm going too fast. I need to slow down, not entirely, but I needed to slow down a little bit. To make room for, well, me, I guess. <laughs> I'm not used to being this wide in the in the back. I have a tail, but it's it's only a little bit, right? I have a big ass, but not that big, you know. Oh, uh oh, S slow down, please. Okay. For this particular um, cargo, I slow down a lot faster than you would expect. Not so much momentum when I'm always being dragged down. <laughs> Any time now. Well, that's interesting. The uh, the mirror on the uh, the left side just goes away. I like that actually. Well, that's not a very useful camera angle. There we go. I'm not sure what the holdup is. Unfortunately, I can't get out and check. That would be very useful in a game like this. Just get out of your vehicle and see what's going on ahead of you. <sighs> but I guess I'm going to be stuck here for a while. Um, does anybody have a good story they want to tell? Maybe their, uh, their favorite snack of some type? Oh, actually, um... If you had to pick between pancakes and waffles, which one would you pick and why? Personally, I really like waffles, but that's because they can hold more syrup on top. It, it's like small individual packets for you.
I wonder how long we'll be here. <sighs> it's right there. My destination is right there. Pancakes with hash browns, eggs, and steak. Well, I didn't ask what you would eat with them. <laughs> um, though that does sound very, very good. Um, minus the uh, minus the steak part, since I'm a vegetarian. But I love everything about what you just said. That sounds very delicious right now. <sighs> Aren't even stuck behind anything. The car in front just decided not to drive. The traffic is backed up pretty far. Oh, just pancakes then. Warm and fluffy with syrup and butter melts onto the pancake. Yeah, yeah, I really do um, appreciate that. Pancakes, I have too many childhood memories. I can honk, but that doesn't really change anything. I can also use my air horn. I'm debating going around the police car, but I'm not sure the uh, the boat would appreciate that. <sighs> I'm just sort of stuck here, I guess. I'm not sure what that that truck right there is doing, but all we're doing is holding up all of the traffic. This isn't even my fault. I didn't do this. Uh, but yes, for uh, for pancakes, one of my favorite ways to have them. I've never had butter on mine. Um, I, I guess the butter would be inside, but um, for what you would have on it is you would have uh, maple syrup, of course, um, and then uh, you ha would have a little bit of peanut butter as well, um, followed by putting cinnamon on top of it, and then it just the 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 flavor mixture is very delicious. Looks like maybe the game might have glitched because it looks like the truck is frozen in place. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that. Um, I guess just try to go around. Sort of defeats the point of the escort, though. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Um, you could load a checkpoint. Yes, I would love to load a checkpoint. It unfortunately took some of my money out, but... I was not going to sit there forever. <sighs> oh well. Hopefully it won't put me back too far. Oh, right here. Oh good, I can move now. All I needed to do was destroy myself and the car in front of me, and then I was able to go again. I'm really glad for these checkpoints. Well, the reason that car was there was because it was sort of stopping other cars from getting in the way. Which I guess it didn't do its job very well about. But hey, we're moving again. That's really good. Oh, slow down, please. Not all the way, but... Okay. I guess I'm slowing down all the way. Okay, you're stopping there because you don't need to go in there with me. Excellent. So it's just me now. I don't have to worry about any vehicle in front of me. And that's good. I like that. Top trucker tip, destroy yourself. <laughs> well, if you don't destroy yourself, how are you going to ever know that what you're doing is right? Skip the delivery. I'm not going to skip the delivery. 
I never skip the delivery if I can help it. Right there, though. Um. Oh, it's not. Well, I. All right. Um. Nope. I want something like this. Oh, I didn't back up far enough. Um... You know what? Good enough. I tried. I really, really did. But I leveled up now. But So now I'm a, I'm a workhorse. <laughs> I would like to change that to work moose, please. Oh, you can't see it because the chat's in the way. Well, now you can sort of see it, I guess. Okay, now I can go... Um, more... Uh, fragile. Or more of these things. Okay, so what, um, explosives, gases, flammable liquids, flammable solids, class 6, toxic, and corrosive substances. Am I allowed to get any of them that I choose? Like that one? <laughs> I'm not sure how much the uh, the stream is delayed. Oh, okay. It seems to be okay. I unfortunately lost a few followers um, partway through the journey. Or not followers, viewers is what I meant to say. But that's okay. I can have flammable solids is what I have now. Oh yeah, <laughs> might have just been you. Okay, um, yeah, I'm going to be able to transport flammable solids now. Um, it's almost to the end of the stream, but I think I can go a little bit longer um, if I pick a uh, if I pick another job. Uh, thank you for confirming, Tab. Um, somewhere out of Newport, please. Okay, I don't really want any of the wide ones. They want an important delivery of sawdust panels? I think I'll, I think I'll do this one, just because it interests me a lot. Oh, I'll be going down the coast. Okay. You guys will get to see the uh, the waterfront. Which I did do a little bit in the past. I think I've actually done this road before. Where does this go? Well, that goes north up the coast. I think I'll go north up the coast. Um, it expires in two and a half hours, which is okay. Um, I'm going to set that uh, destination as my GPS. Which is apparently here. Okay. I can pick up the job here. Oh, a little too early. But there we go. Uh, the freight market. Yes, this is the one I wanted. Thank you. But also, I don't know about any of these. I think this one will be okay. This is the one I want to do. So I have to go find it, I guess. Is it this one? I think it might be this one.
right there should be good. There we go. And now I'm off again. And this is just how it'll go on uh, on Mondays now. Oh, uh oh, I'm not sure I have enough clearance to get out. Okay, I do. This isn't a boat. I should be fine. Uh, I'm. I've begun uploading the uh, the stream archive, uh, the older streams, to YouTube. I have a YouTube channel, um, just for my my Twitch archives, uh, because it deletes after one week because I'm not uh, an affiliate or anything. So if you'd like to catch a past stream, I think the link is below. I'm not entirely sure. I haven't looked at my main page in a while. Uh, so if that interests you, then please take a look. Oh, I'm going over the, uh, the speed limit. I'd like to turn here, please. Oh, I'm, I'm getting a lot of lag right now. I think it's good that I'll be ending the stream soon. My computer is, is chugging along right now. It, it might just be this area. Okay, thank you very much, Catbag. I'll be posting all of my past streams there. Um, I really should put the uh, the same series videos into playlists together. Now, now that I think about it. Okay, I think I'll finish this job and then if it doesn't get too laggy in between and it's not just this area then I'll I'll end the stream there. But thank you everyone for being here the whole time. I, I really appreciate um, all the support I've been getting. And I hit another follower goal today, which is really exciting. I've been doing a little bit of uh, networking um, off of Twitch, just on Discord and stuff. Um, and it's been really working for me, thankfully. Oh. Um, now I'm not very good at it, I don't think. Um, I still haven't set up a, uh, a Twitter yet. Um, one that would be for just, uh, for my Twitch career, and not my, my personal one. That I don't really want to share. Um... Oh, I'm going way too fast. So I think I'll ask somebody for help setting up a, a Twitter that I can uh, post my thoughts about and, and different games that I want to play or I'm thinking about and different friends I'd make, stuff like that. And now I'm not sure Twitter is the best place to do that anymore. Um, there's a website for uh, that's, that's like a social media but just for VTubers that I might that I've really been meaning to sign up for. Um, so hopefully I'll, I'll do something like that. Okay, the speed limit is going to, to look, go lower now. It's going down to 40, yeah. I don't need to be afraid of the, uh, the curb anymore. I don't have the boat. Boats are scary, and if you have one, then you scare me. I went a little over the line that time. <sighs> oh. 
Okay. From what I've seen, Twitter has good VTuber networking stuff. Well, the issue with that is I'd have to be able to post a lot and, and sort of do the meme posts, I guess. Um, you see a lot of uh, stuff like stop scrolling and look at me, I'm a VTuber sort of stuff. I'm not... I don't really like that, I guess. It seems too attention grabby. Like, I don't know. I'm... It's hard to think about. I'm not very good at sort of stuff. Oh, speeding. Oh, I was wondering why I got a, a ticket. Um, if you talk to me on uh, on Discord, um, I would love if you would... Uh, well, if somebody would be able to help me manage... Uh, social media stuff. Just sort of, I come up with uh, different posts and then it's scheduled and, and dealt with and networking happens. I'm not very good at any of that. I would need some help if I want to be, uh, if things to go properly. I do really like that I have my own truck now. It's just the same interior every time instead of always having to memorize where all the different uh, things are. Uh, Catbag, could you message me on uh, Discord, please, just in a PM, and we can discuss it after the stream? I'd really appreciate that, if if, uh, if, if you're willing to do that. I need to be in that lane. Oh, wrong. Wrong button. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, I'm on the wrong side of the road now. Welcome to Pacific City. You always want to set your cruise control to five below the speed limit in case you start going down a hill or there's someone in front of you. You want to have a little bit of a buffer um, before you hit anything, just to avoid crashing, right? Taking damage and having to spend more money to fix your truck. Also, I'm getting uh, pretty close to needing to sleep again, it seems. I could have slept there if I wanted to. <sighs> so far things are going pretty good, I, I think. I'm in 
I do like the uh, the trees around us. It's difficult to know where my truck is when I'm turning like that. Going straight is a lot easier, but when I'm turning, it's a lot more difficult. Yeah, I really... Um, I can't really look at this moment. Um, but usually, if I'm able to, let me... Something like that. Just sort of a, a brief look to the left. It's difficult to do when you're in a moving vehicle. Oh, actually, um, my mouse is going off the the mouse pad on the on the left a little bit. But yeah, you can see the ocean there. That's the uh, that's the biggest ocean in the world. I've never been to it myself. I, I would love to, but unfortunately, it it take a long time walking across uh, all of Canada to get to uh, to British Columbia. And as much as I like walking, um, that, that is a little much for me. And plus I have an obligation to do Twitch now. Well, maybe not an ob maybe the obligation is the wrong word, but I do feel that I uh, should keep up to a schedule. Just so people who do want to hang out and uh, sort of vibe on stream can. Things are going really smoothly now. You can only really go 55 uh, according to the, uh, the street signs, or well, road signs. Um, 55 in miles per hour is 89 in kilometers per hour. Where am I on the map? Okay, we're going. We're going up here. I'm not sure I'll have anywhere to sleep um, if I end up needing it. Oh, this seems like the last place before quite a bit. Um, I should probably rest then. I press F6. They expect... Um, Next rest stop in three hours. Okay, so I'm actually going to be fine. And they the job expects it to be there before seven hours. Okay. So just press F6 if you want to know uh, the information. Also, I discovered Astoria. Oh. I'm slowing down. Oh, okay. Hang on, hang on. We're about to go over something very beautiful looking. And there's a boat there too. Um, now I'm not carrying this boat, so it's, it's a lot better than uh, 
than the last one. Right there. Where am I on the map? Well, apparently the northernmost point of Oregon, there is uh, a large river area. Okay, boat has gone through. Thankfully there's something interesting going on when I'm stopped this time, as opposed to the last time. I should really upgrade my truck to have a, a sleeping cabin. I think that's what I'll do right before I end the stream. I'm not sure it costs too much. And I am level 10 now, I can do that. to be careful. There we go. Perfect. Okay, I'm about to go downhill, so I need to be careful. I just saw I just saw a killer whale on the right side. Jump over the rock. It was a free willy moment. Minnow, you just missed free willy. <laughs> It just happened seconds ago. I'm going too fast. Oh. I didn't know that was a thing that could happen in this game. I'm really excited about that. <laughs> Am I... Oh, I'm not too far to the right. Oh, good. You know, for a game just about delivering packages, this is um, a very interesting one. There's a lot of stuff that happens in it. Oh, too fast. Also, I need to need to turn. So, need to go to Aberdeen apparently. I'm not exactly aligned properly, unfortunately. But it does give me time to think, I guess. Oh, okay. We waited for a boat. Um, we saw Free Willy. And uh, we're getting close to the end here. I hear a helicopter up above. We're going north or along the 101. In case you want to follow along on Google Maps or something. Mm -hmm. Oh. Smaller non transport truck driving by. I have a very large blind spot right now on the left. So if there were any vehicle coming, I wouldn't know. Oh, okay. Ooh, 
This seems like a peculiar place to, uh, to have a bridge. But here we go. Okay, so that one's really tall up. I'm not sure why that side of the bridge is so high up. Need to make sure I don't go over the speed limit while going downhill, which is very difficult with so much momentum. Okay, I need to... I need to turn here. Oh, okay. Guess I'm taking an illegal left on a on a red. Thankfully, I wasn't charged for it. And now there seems to be a tunnel, so that's okay. Oh, and it's raining. Um, I think P was yeah. Wipers are is the P key. Oh, it isn't even that long of a tunnel. Okay. I was worried I would have to turn on my wipers for no reason, but... <laughs> yeah, it's raining, Miss Nobody. It's the summer rain that we all want. Yep, I, uh, I really like when uh, the weather lines up like that, personally. This is nice. Just hearing the sound of the rain on the roof of the truck, it, it feels very nostalgic for me. Not a truck specifically, but... Just quietly listening to the rain on, on your roof. It's very nice. Uh-oh. Um, I would like for you to hurry up. Speed up, please. I don't want to have to slow down because of you. Seems I'll have to, though. Oh, you're still... Okay. I didn't have to slow down entirely, thankfully. Going across the water again. There's a lot of rivers in this area. Oh, so I'm getting very tired. Um, and my break will be after the next job, which thankfully I can rest uh, there. Uh, but also that is where I'll be ending the stream. Just so everyone here knows, uh, our time together is limited. <laughs> What's up ahead here? Oh, seems like an accident. Okay, I'll slow down a little bit. Oh! There was a herd of, uh... Some type of animal. I didn't quite see what it was. I'm glad they weren't hit. Lots of interesting things happening on this particular job. I'm glad I decided to take it. Yeah, I know I'm very tired. I can't wait for when you get affiliate and then you have your own emotes. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be very, uh, it's gonna be a lot more fun like that. Um, I'm not sure what sort of emotes I'll have, to, I'll have, um, I'll have to ask my partner to do more art. Hopefully they'll be okay with that. I can bypass the station, excellent. Um, I, I was asked, uh, by somebody on Twitter if they could draw one of my emotes. I told them I have no money right now. I, I'm just... Things aren't uh, as well economically as they normally are. Um, and they were able to talk me out of 30 cents for something. Um, but then they got really upset when the... Uh, when it said that it was $0.3. Because they didn't, under they didn't seem to understand that that meant 30 cents. Um, it was, was a very interesting conversation. Um... I'm not sure I'd ever want to repeat something like that, but it was... It was weird. I discovered Aberdeen. I'm getting tired. Yeah, thankfully, at the end of the, uh... At the end of this bridge... Um, there is uh, a, a rest stop. I'll finish the delivery, go to the rest stop, and then I'll end the stream there. Thank you everyone for being here. Uh, the viewer count has been the highest it's been since I started um, consistently, which has been very nice. It started with four or five people here, which is very different than what I'm used to. I'm usually used to zero or two around there. Um, I think I am growing in popularity, which I'm very happy about. Also, my music seems to have ended. Oh. Huh. Um, is everyone still here? The music page stopped loading. Okay. I was wondering if my internet went out or not. It must have been earlier. <laughs> hey, caps lock just means you're excited, which is which is okay. Hopefully I'll be able to finish the job before before I have to go to sleep. All this waiting has taken off a lot of time. It seems the rain is coming to an end. As soon as the cars in front of me decide to go. There we go. Stop here on red. Maybe I'll avoid the Pacific Northwest um, from now on, just so I can avoid waiting at so many bridges. I would prefer the unimpeded road, if possible. Oh, now there's a train track. That's the other form of transport that you can get. Oh, the train is... It looks like it'll be a while. <sighs> well, this is unfortunate. I was stopped by three bridges and a train. It looks like it's going for a while, too. Oh, wait, maybe maybe it's ending soon. Okay, there we go. I know I'm getting tired.
It's not actually my fault that I'm this tired around the end of the job. I was trying to... I was trying to end it. Oh, please, no. Oh, that was a lot more expensive than normal. Sorry about hitting your car. I didn't mean to. This is a non-turning lane, but I think I'll be I think I'll be okay. Just need to wait for the two vehicles beside me to either go through or turn. Okay, I guess I won't be waiting for that car. Oh, there's another... Getting really tired of these red lights. It seems as if the, uh, the game doesn't want me to stop playing. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Last red light, and then I can just actually end. <laughs> Alright. Turning here for anyone behind me who wants to know what I'm doing. Okay, I would like to do that version, please. And it looks very nice seeing my truck from uh, top-down view like this. There we go. Job complete. Now I find somewhere to, uh, to sleep and then I'll call it a stream. Okay, where can I sleep in the area? Uh, map. I would like that space, please. Which means I have to leave this sort of space here. Oh. Which I can't do this way, so I have to turn around. Do a three-point turn in a in a truck. <laughs> okay. I can go through a red. It's fine. Is it right here? Is this the space? I think this is the space. It is, yes. Okay, we sleep and then we, we end the game. Oh, it's... Well, thank you everyone for being here. Um, 
I know it was a little crazier than normal, um, with a lot more action. Uh, hopefully that was okay. Um, we've hit our follower goal. Uh, thank you for being here. Um, and just in general, let me reload my music program for just the end here. Just the last little talking bit. There we go. It didn't feel complete without it. Uh, but yes, yeah, so thank you everyone for being here. Um, and for being for following me, just for, in general, just, I'm very glad that this has been working out as it has. Um, I can't tell you how much I appreciate that streaming has just been something that's worked out for me. Um, I'm so used to things just not going my way. Uh, so I'm very happy that this seems to be... Oh. So, um, that's it for today. Uh, I will be back again on Wednesday um, at 5 p.m. Um, my time zone, which is Eastern Standard Time, um, for more House Flipper. Uh, thank you very much, Nico. Um, if you would like to uh, follow me for House Flipper, then I will be here on Wednesday, as I said. Um, and that's it. Thank you, everyone, and I hope you have a good night. Um, I'm going to open my window and then rest my back. Uh, thank you, everyone, and have a good night.